Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a cool tone um, makeup tutorial. This is completely different than what I would ever do. I'm not a cool girl. Well, I am, but you know, <laughs> you know what I mean. I'm not a cool tone makeup girl. Um, but I really like how it came out. I did a halo eye with grayish color lipstick. Um, so yeah, if you want to see how I got it done, then keep watching. Alright, so I've already primed my lid. Now I'm going to go in with the Lorac uh, Pro 2 palette and I'm going to be using a crease brush with this nectar color right here. And I'm going to put that all over the crease as a transition shade. Crease brush. I'm going to use the color Cool Gray. the outer corner and the inner corner. Just keep packing it on until I get the desired effect. Alright, I'm going to take a smaller crease brush like this with the same color and I'm going to pack it a little closer to the lash line. I'm going to take this color over here, which is charcoal, and I'm going to mix it with cool gray. That's the outer bay. Give it one dimension. Flat brush. I'm going to take a small flat brush. I'm going to take this color chrome. I put that directly in the center of the lid. Now with the bigger um, crease brush, I'm going to take that color Nectar again, and I'm just blend out the edges. Okay. Now I'm going to mix the two colors, um, silver and chrome, and I'm going to put that directly on the lid. Okay, now with my finger, because your finger for any color that is not like coming up, coming up, out pigmented enough, it'll make it a lot more pigmented. I'm gonna take that silver color on its own and I'll put it directly in the center of my lid. Okay, now with a small brush, I'm gonna take the Laroc palette, the original one, and I'm gonna take that white. White is so pigmented, so make sure you tap it off. And I'm gonna put that right on the arch of my brow. Now I'm gonna do a small wing, like I did this one. Hopefully, I can get it this eye as well because y'all know I suck. I'm gonna be using the Maybelline Eye Studio Black uh, Eye Studio Gel Eyeliner. And the color black is black and an angled brush and I always put it in the back of my hand to kind of warm up the product because I find that it helps. Okay, now let's curl our lashes. I'm going to use my blow dryer. Hot. Yeah. I kind of just hold it when it's really hot so I can just hold the curl. Bam. Okay, girl. Now I'm going to use the CoverGirl Lash Blast Mascara, same one I always use. I already put foundation on my face. Now we're going to move on to concealer. I'm going to use the L'Oreal True Match Concealer in W4.5. That's why I really like this concealer, it's not bad. Now 
Now I'm gonna take a tapered brush and I'm gonna use a Ben Nye banana powder. I just pour some in the cap. And I'm going to set my under eye with that. I'm gonna use whatever's left in the cap and I'm gonna just set the rest of my face around your nose. Back to eyes. I am going to use the color cool gray on my lower lash line and I'm just going to use a regular pencil brush for that. Now I just wipe off that same pencil brush and I'm going to use the color I'm gonna use the color buff right here in this little rock too. It's a matte like ivory shade. And I'm gonna put that right in the inner corner and just blend that with the cool gray. Just brighten it a little bit. Now I'm gonna take a coal liner, like um, eyeliner, and I'm gonna put that in my upper waterline. Now I'm gonna go ahead and curl my lashes one more time. I'm gonna heat up. Here it out one time. Heat it up. Just be careful don't burn your damn eyelid off. a little bit of mascara on my lower lash line. Right. I'm going to contour a little bit, but I'm going to use, I want a cooler tone to contour. And I'm going to use, this is the MAC Sculpt. And just a regular contour brush. First, did the contour line. I'm gonna put on that. I'm gonna put down my nose. On the sides. You can already see the difference, you see? Makes it, if you put a little line here, it makes it look like your nose is a little up. Not everyone likes that. I do. No. All an illusion. Just make sure you blend everything out because you don't want to look crazy. Now I'm going to go in with a blush. Normally I wouldn't really use a blush for a look like this, but I'm going to use NARS Seduction, which is like a deep um, burgundy color. It looks scary, but it's really not. Okay. So just with that, I always use a stippling blush. Stippling brush with my blush. Is that right? Because it just doesn't, it's not so harsh, you know? And lightly on the apples of your cheeks. I'm gonna use Becca Moonstone poured, which is just a little bit of it's um just a little bit. It's a cream. I'm gonna use that. I'm 
Becca highlighter in Opal. Yeah. Tap it off. The sun is down so you can't see my highlight. But it's there. And I'm going to take um, the Kat Von D shade and light palette. I'm just gonna mix all three colors and kind of sharpen up my contour just to keep kind of bathed. Okay, now on to lips. I'm gonna use the Lime Crime Lipstick in Cashmere. It's like a taupey grayish color, which I absolutely love. So, do a light scratch. I'm not going to use the lip liner just because I don't have one that matches this color and I don't want the color to really change. Alright you guys, this is the completed look. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace. My biggest fear is that I'm making it doing a YouTube tutorial or YouTube tutorial or makeup tutorial and I have a fucking booger hanging out. Can you imagine? The muero. Oh my god. No. <laughs> Ew, child. I'm losing my eye. Like, for sure, I'm losing my eye. For sure. No doubt about it. I'm sure people do that. It's some crazy people out there right now. Crazy ass. I might be one of them. But now I'm sitting with my makeup. Don't do that, bro. Can we talk about my lashes? How it looks like I have fake lashes on, but they're mine. Thank you so much. Blow dry that itch. I'm telling you. Just if you burn your eyelid off, I don't want to hear it.